Turkish opposition blames government for country's dire post-quake plight. Turkey's six-party opposition coalition has lashed out at Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan for mishandling the aftermath of the February the 6th earthquake. The opposition links the enormous number of victims and the devastation with the government's inefficient actions. Apparently, the opposition is trying to use this catastrophe to score pre-election points, say senior researcher at the Russian Academy of Sciences at Primakov Institute of World Economy and International Relations, Viktor Nadien Reyevsky. Opposition politicians and reporters have been openly saying lately that Erdogan was ushered in with an earthquake and will leave with an earthquake. Comparing the predicament to a similar disaster in 1999 which launched Erdogan's rise, the expert reiterated, Russian International Affairs Council expert Kirill Semenov thinks that Erdogan and his party will use this emergency for their own benefit. The Turkish president has everything, including administrative resources provided by the natural disaster. This is both the state of emergency in southeastern provinces and the right to provide emergency financial aid and extraordinary measures in punishing those guilty of violating construction norms. He said, the opposition's accusations will be presented by the authorities as something immoral, the expert thinks. Amur Gadziev, a researcher at the Russian Academy of Sciences Institute of Oriental Studies, points out that the opposition still has not selected a single presidential contender for the coming election slated for May or June. Nor does it have any clear formulas for handling the disaster's aftermath or plans for economic and political reforms besides the return to a parliamentary republic from the presidential one, he added. The six parties got united in criticizing Erdogan and his party for violations which led to the loss of life which allowed them to retain their shaky bloc. That said, this limits their opportunities to create a positive agenda, particularly at the current critical moment, the expert says, pointing out that Erdogan has already started handing out various payments and compensation. 